Welcome back to my channel. Let's talk social media planners. So I love this hardbound print pression. I think it is just pretty and fun and I decorated it for the month of June and I was adding in my using it as social media. I thought I might try to use this as a daily um, and I was giving it a whirl but I don't know. And I still might mess around with it a little bit here and there, um, perhaps. So I kind of gave up on that aspect of it. And I'm actually thinking I'm gonna pull this out. Um, these stickers are just set in there. I love how this looks. I just think it's neat. Uh, I love buying the kit and having it fit perfectly, but I'm not sure, I'm not sure about this planner. So here I have some of my social media kinds of stickers, and that is a leftover kit from July and August. And these are from Coffee Monsters Co. I just thought these were really cute and thought that they would be fun to have as little calendars. And I really like the pink. I like the silver as well. And I think this silver book goes well. Um, I also decorated it, used a different kit. And then I thought, I think since this is monthly, I might use it for my social media because it has so many months in it. Um, this one only has three months in it because it's a daily and it's already set up for July. So I was thinking I should have just written my July videos in it, but I wanted to do something with this part for um, my videos and my social media. So although this kit was already used. I think I'm just going to decorate July. And as you can see, I already wrote some stuff in it because I already wrote some stuff in it. <laughs> and I was thinking of maybe putting this planner in the pink, even though I think the gray is really pretty. I'm thinking about putting it here in the pink and I know that I don't have the cover on and that's because sliding the cover and this in and out is icky. This is some beach paper from Stampin' Up that I think is pretty and I think it'll go in the pink as well. In fact, it's quite lovely in the pink. So with regards to this, I'm not sure yet. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do. It, I do like it, don't get me wrong. And I, I like the size. I just think it's a neat size. And maybe I will do a little play around. And I love this cover. I think this cover is fun. So I, I don't know. This is a question mark. It could be just one of those, I feel like planning today. So I'm going to plan today. Um, so here is July. I think that's so cute. I think I'm going to still slip these in so I can see the monthly. And I have some Coffee Monsters Co. Instagram stickers. I'm thinking about keeping some stickers back here or maybe even in the zip. I don't know. Or just in front. I'm not sure. I've got my YouTuber scripts from uh, Coffee Planner Mom and my film scripts from Coffee Planner Mom and some Coffee Monsters Co. Instagrams, which I'd like to use before I use the other ones. And then I have these from Happy Planner. So I don't know. That's not real cute, is it? 
but I don't know where else to, to put them. I suppose I could hide them behind here. And then that way I still have the cuteness minus that, but I'm gonna use those up first. So maybe I'll do that. So, and I'm not sure how I feel about these strings either. Initially, I thought I'd like them, but then I don't know, they kind of bug me. So maybe, maybe the strings will live in the back. Anyway, so there's June, here's July, poor July. It, uh, it looks really sad. Let's get some numbers. July starts on a Thursday. And I don't have tiny ones that are that are all there. So I might have to cut. Um, I could use these. Let's use these. This kit, I'm gonna use the blue. So July starts on the first, Thursday. Thursday, Friday, Saturday. All right, so I'm gonna lay all these down and I'll see you when I'm finished. So actually I'm not finished, but um, <laughs> I, I thought of something to say. So I love, love planning and I really have enjoyed my classic size happy planner, my big happy planner, especially when we were all in lockdown for COVID because there weren't a lot of plans and I could use all those big florals and the big stickers and still have room for all of the things. Um, the big planner though took up just a little more space on my kitchen table than I would like. And I thought about going back to classic, but the idea of a TN and setting up a TN and having frou-frou-y things just thrilled me. So I experimented with some Lights Planner Action TN and discovered that I really like the B6 TN and that's where I wanna be for my catch-all. And I also discovered that I really enjoyed having everything in one spot. Um, my social media, my reading, I want it all in one spot. So what I, when I figured that out, um, I went back on Lights Planner Action and I picked up a monthly and I picked up uh, the reading and some other things that will go in my B6TN so that my catch-all is just one thing. However, I need to keep track of things before that order comes. So I'm utilizing what I have. And you might say, well, gee whiz, Gail, if you're gonna utilize what you have, why don't you just use the other July calendar? Well, yeah, I could, um, but I'm not, I'm doing this. And uh, it makes me happy. And I find planning relaxing. I definitely have plenty of stickers. Um, I just enjoy it and I really like making these videos. I hope you enjoy watching them. Um, I'm guessing you must because people do watch them and comment so I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Um, yeah and you know feel free to leave a comment below. What, what would you like to see? Plus you know I do PR for Coffee Planner Mom and her stickers are classic happy planner sized. So if you're not a classic happy planner girl or an Erin Condren or a Recollections, you might think, well, then I can't use these stickers. They're not made for me. Yeah, they are. Use them in whatever planner you want. And, um, and so I use a lot of different planners to show. Yeah, they might be too small in a big. They might be too big for a B6, but cut them, trim them, layer them. Um, do what makes you happy.
so and, and that's just what I'm doing here doing what makes me happy so 30 dates have September April June and November there are 31 in July it's hard to believe tomorrow's actually gonna be July 1st you're going to see this later <coughs> excuse me you're going to see this I actually think I have to flip-flop I think I put something else there but we'll see um, anyway, so I'm gonna put this away. So what I have here is a mini kit from the Coffee Monsters Co. I want to say it's like a Hobonichi kit or something. Mini kit, summer fun mini kit. Look how cute it's mini. And I just, you just buying something like this that's tiny and cute floats my boat. Now I have to put these sideways, but I don't care. I'm gonna do it and they're gonna overlap a little and again I don't care it's fine uh, yeah love it whoops I almost put Thursday on Wednesday that would have been silly so yeah I I just love it and um, my hubby fully supports my crazy obsession um it's just a lot of fun I like it okay so there we have that and I'm going to want some data you know since I'm using this I don't think I'm going to need any of these I'm going to set those off to the side um let's do the water here at the bottom and we'll do this water here at the bottom and this is kind of fun I might do this over here perhaps A little starfish action little ice cream let's do this beach beauty uh -huh. cute and I'm gonna do um, maybe this down here I want My subs. I'm gonna put it on a pink post-it. So I'm gonna label that subs. And then I'll write my number in tomorrow. That's fun. Now let's see. This week I have a collab, so I need to label that. I'm going to put this pink one here. I'm doing a collab with Holly from Holy Granola 27. And we're going to be using a coffee planner mom deluxe sheet. You'll have to leave me a comment. I hauled those recently. Would you like to see strawberry? Do you think, not would you like to see, because we've already decided. Would you, what do you think? Um, the popsicles? or the butterflies, or the strawberries. What do you think I'll be doing? So that's kind of fun. All right, typically I decorate some boxes and write some different things. Um, but since I had already written those in, maybe, um, one, two, three, four. No, I only need one, two, three, and I have three left. So this will be my plan with me B6. Plan with me, we'll do that because that's kind of fun. And we'll put this in because it's done. Uh -huh. And we'll put this in 
and we'll put this in. You know what? I don't know that I want to do that. That's kind of weird. Is that weird? It is weird. Let's do this instead. That was weird. We'll just put three different ideas here. One, two, three. And Okay, so that's the collab with Holly. I thought I would use like some of this pretty decoration here at the bottom, but this one kind of goes, doesn't it? Let's put this here just to be pretty. And maybe we'll layer this over it because, you know, I might have something to say. Um... Yeah. Maybe ideas. I know I'm gonna have to do my food Friday again. I have a few ideas for that. All right, so that's kind of fun. So let's jump ahead. See, that says June, but now we're going to be in July. So I have these tabs. Let me grab them. Here they are, and I need July. So I'm just going to leave them in there because, you know, why not? So if that is June, let me turn it so I can line it up. I'm going to put July next. July. Very good. That's cool. So this is July. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. This is July 1st. Hmm. Let's pull out my numbers. I have big ones. Here we are. But no one. Darn it. All right, I'm going to cut this 31 and make a one. I know I could actually write them in, but, you know, I have a sticker. Why as well use it? So I can actually use the one and the three. So I shall. One, that'll be two. This will be three, and that'll be four. So June has 30 days. That was actually, that's actually today. Yesterday was the 29th. And Monday was the 28th. Those are nice bright colors, huh? Um, I'm going to take the 14th and cut it into a 1 and a 4 because I'm short a 1 later. So I'll probably need it at some point. I'll stick it in there use this four and I need a two so 
Um, if I have a 24, I don't. All right, sorry, 27, I'm gonna use you. Just a random, random grab. I'll keep the seven in case I need them. I'm gonna grab the two. Stick him down. Okay. How about some days of the week? And how about some months? So, I think I'm gonna use this. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll just put this here. July. And then that way we'll know that's June. <clears throat> yeah, that'll be fine. Okay, I like those really bright, bright colors. So we need some days of the week. I have this spool of Simply Gilded. Days of the week, they would go there. I should have thought ahead. Duh. Silly girl. Thank goodness those peel up. So yeah, I don't I don't know that I'll be able to continue this. I don't I don't know how much I'll use it. I don't I don't know. There's a lot of questions. But you know, when you're starting a new planner, there are a lot of questions, aren't there? I mean, you try different things, um, you experiment, you know, and you just do whatever that makes you happy. And um, I also find that when you watch other people that you learn little tips and tricks, maybe even learn what not to do. Um, so there you have that. I think I fell in love with the print impression hardbound. I follow a girl in the UK, two of them actually, that use both, both girls use these print impressions. And um, I just was like, that is the neatest size planner ever. And I love it. I think it's a neat like notebook size. Um, and I recently purchased and hauled a B6 bundle thinking that I could turn the B6 into a TN, one of these. I thought there were strings underneath the rings, but there aren't. Today on my walk, I was thinking to myself, I bet if I take those rings off and I bought some elastic cording, I could sew in and make it a TN. Um, the reason I'm saying that is because I do have a TN from Simply Gilded and it's that white one. You know the one, it's right here, let me grab it. And I love it, but I was thinking I might wanna branch out to other colors. So if you know where I can get just TNs, B6, TN, in a variety of colors, let me know. I want it with strings so that I can put in my four um, notebooks. Let me know. Leave a comment below. All right, so there's that. And then I need some sort of a to-do or this week or let's use this weekend banner since I have it weekend it's pretty um I think I'll do this and I think that will be for posts get rid of one of these I might get rid of a whole bunch of them let's peel that back up let's post down. Isn't that cute? Ha ha. So 
Um, did I post? I'm gonna put a post for every day because um, this summer I wanna make sure that I do. I wanna be more active on Instagram. So I'm probably out of camera frame. So I'm gonna use these and I'm just putting them all over up and down because um, I don't wanna make a, you know, I don't want them in the same spot and make a, a bump in my planner. This I think I'm gonna put in the same spot because it's the weekend and I don't know how active I'll be. And now I have this and I can slip it better in here. So there you go. And I'm going to take my film edit. Oh, that did not work. Okay, just cut it off, Gail. There we go. And now I'm going to take my YouTuber scripts because I have been filming, editing, and uploading like a fiend every day this week. I like it. I love doing this. I find it a lot of fun. Um, yesterday, I have to tell you, I was, I had filmed a video and I had uploaded it and it just sat there for hours and didn't do a thing. Couldn't believe it. I'm going to do one more for Friday and not this weekend. So, okay. So, what else? Um, hmm. Maybe I'll do a little checklist every day, too. So, I don't want the two pinks together, so I'll put one down here. And I might not do anything on the weekend. This is July 4th. So maybe we'll go like that. There goes the phone again. I'm gonna put 4th of July. Another junk call, man. It's really aggravating. Here we go. Do I have a 4th of July? I have Independence Day. Let's use that. Independence Day. Good. Okay. And I think I'll just put... I was going to put up one of these boxes just to use it. I don't even know if I will. Um, we'll do that there and we'll do this little one. These are super tiny and that little one. I don't know if I'll do anything with them. Okay. And I was putting down the checklists. I've got a couple more to put down. Cute and fun. These are super tiny. And I have one more which I'm going to put over here like that. Really cute. Now, because I have these bright colors, I feel like I need to put some bright colors over here. Um, how about this flag? straight though and then we'll do the other flag there we go and I would 
like this to be down here. Let's cut it. And now I've made washi. They're individual boxes, but I think I can just butt them up next to each other and it will look like washi. So see, something didn't fit. So I cut it to make it fit. And you can do the same, um, no matter what your sticker kit is. So don't be afraid. I wouldn't mind a this week for that. washi right in there and you know what I'm not gonna put it in the in the seam hold on let me cut that pick it up and scooch it over do that and maybe I'll just write in black pen myself this week that's fine and maybe I'll take this flag and set it there cute cute huh I like it. All right. Well, that's fun. So yeah, I have a couple of stickers, you know, sheets left. And I think I'll just slip them back here so I have them to use. And then I have this looking cute. That doesn't, it does kind of go, doesn't it? Let's do that. That's fun, a little sparkle. Yeah, I like it. Hmm. Too cute, but it needs, I guess you just go like that, right? Yeah, okay. Well, what do you think? Leave a comment below and let me know. I've asked you for a couple of comments to this post, so. Feel free to address one or all of them. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. And if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And I will see you next time. Thanks so much for joining me. Bye.